You might be familiar with Irish rolls. They're not edible, they just sound really cool. Hey fiddlers, welcome to today's fiddle focus video. Today I'm gonna to be taking you through three different ornaments that I like to add to fiddle tunes. Ornamentation is something that took me a little while to get the hang of as a fiddler, but now I literally cannot help myself. I add ornaments all over the place because they're just so pretty. They can be kind of subtle, like little quick grace notes or little slides, but they actually just transform a tune. We're gonna be focusing on grace note ornaments today, and I'm just gonna take you through one of my favorite jigs, Smash the Windows, and we're gonna find three places where we can throw in some ornaments. If you'd like sheet music for the tune I'm gonna teach today with the ornamentation written in, you can get that at the link in the description. And if you become a Patreon patron of mine at that link, you can then vote for topics for future videos from me, like this one, and I will do my utmost to oblige. It's a lot of power, you guys. All right, so let's get down to business and learn three ornaments that we can add to the tune Smash the Windows. So first off, a quick word about grace notes. Grace notes are just really quick, sorry Bo. Grace notes are just really quick notes. So for example, this would be a grace note. That second finger note that sort of interrupts the lower note, that's a grace note. You wanna be really light with your left hand fingers when you're playing grace notes. So you're not gonna be pressing the string all the way down. You're just tapping the surface of the string. So every time we play a grace note today, that's good to keep in mind. They're barely even a note, just a quick effect. All right, so we've got that. Let's learn the first ornament. And I don't actually know if there's a name for this ornament, so we're just gonna play it and not worry about it. Here's what the beginning of this tune would sound like without that ornament. Very nice, pretty simple though. We could make it fancier. Here's what it would sound like with that ornament. Did you catch that little? That's the ornament. What's going on is you have these two notes back to back, the open A and the third finger. Those are the principal notes we're dealing with, but between those two notes, we're going to put two quick grace notes, your first finger and then your second finger. So it goes open, one, two, three. But the one, two are super quick. Grace notes is muscle memory, so just do that a bazillion times, really slowly at first, and then gradually getting faster. All right, so that's our first ornament. We've got, and that's the only ornament we're gonna add to the A part. It's gonna come up again later, so after we go, Now we're on to the B part and we're going to learn ornament number two. This one I do have a name for, it's called a half roll. Here's what this part of the tune would sound like without that half roll. Here it is with the half roll. It's that little blip there. You might be familiar with Irish rolls. They're not edible, they just sound really cool. A roll is a five note ornament. so. Typically for a first finger roll, you would play one, two, one, open, one. A half roll is a four note ornament. So you actually leave off the first note of the roll. Before we were going one, two, one, open, one. Now we're just going two, one, open, one. And we do that super quick. So we go. Well, the full roll would take up the dotted quarter, this roll takes up just a quarter note. And you start it right on the beat. So here it is within the tune one more time. So you start that half roll just when the note starts. All right, then we're gonna move on with our lives and we're gonna go. All right, let's move on to our third and final ornament, which is called a hammer-on. Here's the next part of the tune without the hammer-on. Here it is with the hammer-on. It's very subtle, but it was just that little... A hammer-on is when you play a quick grace note right below the principal note. So our principal note here is your third finger. That's 
the note that we're playing with in the actual melody of the tune. But the grace note's gonna come right before that. It's gonna be your second finger. And it happens super quick. You can throw hammer-ons into this tune all over the place. Like you could go. credit. You can also put this hammer on in at the very end of the tune. So after what we just played, we're going to go like this. There it is. So that is the entire tune with those ornaments. I'm just going to play it all the way through for you. I'll raise my eyebrows whenever we play one of the ornaments so that you know what's happening. One, two, three, four. Alright you guys, that does it for today's Fiddle Focus video. I hope you enjoyed learning these three fancy dancy ornaments. They're gonna change your life forever. If you'd like sheet music for the tune with those ornaments written in, you can get those at the link in the description. And at that link you'll also get sheet music and practice tracks for a whole bunch of other fiddle tunes. Plus you can become a patron of mine on Patreon and vote for topics for my future videos. I just want to say a huge thank you to my patrons over on Patreon.com. You guys are amazing and you make it possible for me to do this stuff. Have a wonderful day everyone, happy fiddling, and I will see you very soon. Bye now.